Who's that? Billy. Billy, clever girl. <laughs> Is he coming to say hello? Oh no. <laughs> Do you like the snake? Good morning everyone. Right, the time is just before 6am. I have been up for about an hour. Over, I think, by now. Yeah, quarter to five. I, Elena got up. Um, so, yeah, that's been fun. Um, sorted some of the house out and everything else. Slowly been waking up and doing jobs. I have my cup of tea, so I've been slowly waiting for that to cool down and now consuming that. So, yeah, I will be hopping bye in the shower bye in a minute. Bye-bye, no. no, snake. Bye-bye, snake. All right, sweet pea. Move the, bring the stool back over here then. Elena was just up on a stool saying hello to Billy, our snake. So, yeah, but I need to pop in the shower in a minute because AD had fun last night. She used me as a drawing Whoa. pad, which is absolutely fine. Yeah. I really Mama, don't mind. Be, be, be. Good girl. I've got all my tattoos, so I don't mind what she wants to draw on me and give me some more. But it does mean that I'm now going to have to have a nice big scrub to get them all off my legs. So that'll be happening in a minute. Well, that'll be happening after the twins feed, which is sitting on the side because, well, they were starting to wake up but it looks like I've gotten and got another five minutes so yeah let's get on with things also in this vlog please forgive the state of my house um everything is a bit topsy-turvy right now because Glenn has been doing some decorating things around the house um he I don't know if I said it before, but there was a gap around our ceiling. Hello. Okay, sweet pea, there was a gap around our ceiling um, that was where the walls had been when the ceiling had been done. And obviously we'd never, after that, repainted our ceiling either. So, um, but that is what over about the past three days, four days? that Glenn has been doing, bless him. He polyfilled up the gap around the whole house and then he um, went and painted the ceiling for the whole of the, like the living room, dining room, kitchen and hallway. Bless his heart. Um, so yeah, my house is a bit higgledy-piggledy with things on top of things where they're not meant to be for the minute because they can't live where they're supposed to. So yeah, my kitchen for instance, all of my lovely owl tubs can't live up there where they normally do because obviously yeah so I can't really use my stove <laughs> hopefully um Glenn wants to do finish doing the second coat to it today because he's got the day off so it'll be that in theory they can go back up tomorrow just have to wait and see but yeah so that's what Glenn's been doing this week after work Bless him, and now Elena is just playing with a brolly. You having fun there, Lainey? Yeah. Yeah. You're going to be good while Mummy goes in the shower? No. No? Okay, then. <laughs> right, AD is now finishing getting ready for school. She's up, dressed, even had a shower and got breakfast in her. We managed to get Lainey dressed as well. Lainey, you want to say good morning? Good morning. He says good morning, good morning. Are you going to say good morning? Good morning. <laughs> I hope you have a lovely day. Oh, that's very nice of you, sweetheart. <laughs> so, yeah, she wanted to go to um, Before School Club. So they are now, literally Glenn's only just got out of bed to go to the toilet. He's got dressed, gone to the toilet. And, one. yeah, that's something for school, sweetheart. I need to give you um, some money with it, okay? And then 
and then he'll literally just be out of the door with AD. So, yeah. And then he's got a dentist appointment after school. Elena just waiting by the front door. But you're not going, are you? <laughs> Okay. So yeah, but it's not even eight thirty in the morning, and everyone is dressed and ready for the day. Oh, careful, monkey! <laughs> and yeah, there's not really much else to do around the house today. The twins are oh. <laughs> The twins are awake and smiley and playing in their playpen. Are you two awake? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Aidy's deciding to paint me. <laughs> Which works in regards to obviously drawing on me last night. So I managed to get most of it off. Not entirely. So I'm going to wear jeans today so I can cover them. <laughs> but yeah. Everyone think they're tattoos. I want to see mummy's new tattoo. Do you? Oh. Tattoo. Yeah, she's saying I, it is on my back. Lainey, nicely. Um, it is on my back. I will. I'll video it for you. So, yeah, that's my new tattoo. Adi was very excited to see it when she when I came home, weren't you? <laughs> it's a seven and a moon in it. It is. It's got a little moon in it, which makes that the third moon that Mummy's got on her body, isn't it? Yep. Bye-bye, right, Aidy. Bye. -bye, oh, go, go to school. oh, careful, Lady. Bye-bye. <laughs> so, yeah, there they are. Well, Aidy will be in a second. She's just gone to go get her... Scooter, there she is. Off to school. And Glenn has, as I said, his dentist appointment after dropping her off. So he's going to be there really, really early at this rate. However, they were a bit late in leaving now. So she is going to miss a bit of that before school club. Oh well. Now, I'm not actually sure what else there is for me to do aside from general tidying. So I should probably get on that, shouldn't I? So, I was doing some jobs and I noticed that it was suddenly rather quiet. I went on a hunt for Elena and this is what I found. <sighs> she is curled up in the twins bed with their dummy. Now bear in mind that she hasn't had a dummy for actually since the twins were born so nearly four months she hasn't had a dummy unless she's stolen the twins and now she's fast asleep in their bed with one of their dummies not that they really take that either and I just I don't have the heart to move her so I'm just going to let her have her nap there because the time is ten past nine so it's not too early for her nap um, <clears throat> but yeah so I'm just going to leave her there because I really I just I don't have the heart to wake her up to put her in bed but yeah so she's asleep the twins are still asleep in the playpen. I've done, well, I've done some of the general tidying. Does anyone else ever make it so that the rest of the house will be fine, but then like their bedroom or something will be the place where they put all the rest of it till they can tidy it away? Because that's what I seem to have done. But in all fairness, everything that is in the bedroom belongs in there, I just then need to tidy that away. So, yeah. Glenn came home from the dentist's. <laughs> he is now, his mouth is now fully a nice mouth again after having some teeth pulled and some fillings done. 
over about the past month, I think. He's had about three appointments, isn't it? And now he's not listening to me. But yeah, so I'm sat on the sofa feeding Miss Aria because she woke up first. And Glenn is repainting the ceiling again, which has been rather entertaining to watch. Not so entertaining, however, has been him when he was doing over where I am um, on the sofa. Because obviously now, I had a nice shower this morning, but I'm now covered in white paint splatters. So that's fun. So after I fed Aria, I'm going to have to try and clean my arms down again. But yeah, Elena, the time is quarter past 11 and Elena is still down for her nap. She's still sleeping, bless her. Um, however, last time I checked on her, she had moved. So, um, and this is what she moved to. It was so cute. But yeah, so now we are just waiting for Elena to wake up and then sort her out to go off to nursery. You go to nursery soon? Look who woke up from her nap. She was asleep for like over three hours. It was absolutely crazy. Did you have a good sleep? Yeah. She's just having a packet of crisps before going to nursery. We're going to go see everyone at nursery? Yeah? <laughs> Lick her lips. And then the twins are both just wide awake. In the blade bin. Hello, you two. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Hello, Miss Aria. Oh, are you talking to us? Are you talking to us? But yeah. <laughs> right. So, yeah. Glenn has finished the ceiling. It looks really good. Or at least I think it does. It's all like mostly dry now, so it's all even, and I think it looks really good. So forgive my hair. Can't it does not what does not know what it's doing. But yeah. So now let's time to go get ourselves sorted and go to nursery. Right. So it was going to be that I was going to walk to nursery to drop Elena off, and then I was going to go into the city. Um, but because of when Elena woke up, Glenn has been kind enough to drive us to drop Elena off at nursery. That's where we are. And so I'm waiting in the car with the twins, who are curled up, not completely comfortably, but just curled up, bless them, in their car seats, um, while we wait for Glenn to come back. And then he's also being an angel and dropping me into the city. And then picking Adie up from school so that I still have time to do the jobs that I actually need to do in the city. Which is, yeah, reminds me why I love the man. Right. Um, yeah. As you can tell, I am now home. Um, I got quite a few bits in the city which I'll be going through and showing everyone um, when it gets a little bit closer to bedtime because they are presents and a couple of gifts and things just because they were on sale. So I'm really bad for a sale. Um, but yeah, so I went and did all of my jobs in the city, which, yeah, I ended up spending a little bit more than I probably should have because I ended up killing time just in the city till it was time to go pick Elena up from nursery and then I went and picked Elena up from nursery and came home and Glenn picked Adie up from school and took her to a birthday party that was happening in the park next door so ooh, sorry I'm just making Glenn a coffee um and that so that's what our prospective afternoons look like um with all of that and yeah now the girls are playing outside on the trampoline. The girls are out there. The twins are sat in their chairs with me carefully watching over them. And we've got 
YouTube songs on the telly. So yeah, Glenn is now putting up a trim, um, a bit of, what was it? This kind of wood bit is called a trim and it goes around the edge of where the ceiling meets the wall. Um, and Glenn's doing that round Elena's room. Bless his heart. Nervous, I repeat, there's always jobs to do. Um, so yeah, we will, and I'm still carrying on deep clean in the rest of the house that Glenn started to try and get rid of all the paint splatters. So yeah, we're doing that and then it's bedtime soon and maybe some chilling. I don't know, I'm not actually sure what we're doing tonight. So, Lainey, dress down a second. Pretty little girl is going to go from this ready for bed to, to this. All dressed and ready for bed. Are you going to say night night to everyone? Night night. Night night everyone. Go. Where'd Elena go? Where'd Elena go? Pipo. <laughs> oh, where'd Elena go? All right. Night night, babe. Night night world. Night night world. Good girl. <laughs> oh, trim is up. That'll look great in the morning. Right, Aidy, you're going to come here for me. Now stop there. Right, so you're going to see the surprises that I bought you. These two are for both you and your sister. So they're, in other words, they're for all of the kids. Okay. Okay. But if you want, they can live in your room. Okay. <laughs> well, which one would you like to watch tonight as your bedtime movie? Sing. <laughs> Pass me Moana then. <laughs> Alright, what do you say to everyone? Bye. Night, night. Bye, bye. Good girl. Right now, I am sat on the sofa, curled up, having a few munchies and playing Crash Bandicoot which I'm failing at very, very badly. But Glenn, bless him. Tonight, Glenn is the one who is doing a deep clean. He's sorting out all of the dust and everything that was on, well, everything, after his little DIY excursions for the ceiling. And I don't know if I should feel bad or not. I don't feel bad. But I feel like I should feel bad. <laughs> Are you going to be cleaning for the rest of the night? Most of it. Ah. There you go. You've heard it from him himself. A man that likes to... Well, I don't know if he likes to clean. But a man that does clean. Well, I just... I create the mess, so I clean it up. <laughs> yeah, it. Oh, bless you, babe. But, yeah. So, I think that... Is, I think we will end it there for tonight so thank you very much for watching and we will catch you next time bye guys